Okay, so a couple of remarks I want to make before we end this uh, section. The first remark is in the fall in the the previous proofs we've seen the, that the symbolism used for representation um, with respect to a basis B, B um, cannot be overlooked. Uh, that was one of the advantages that we mentioned before. And here's another advantage, the, the advantage that it shows undoubtedly that a representation is a function, okay, from, um, from a vector to uh, N dimensionals in, into an n dimensional subspace, right? So R sub n or R R R N. Okay. That's that's another thing. Also, well defined. So the idea of being well defined um, comes from the dealing with functions, right? So in a well defined function, uh, every every um, object in the domain must have an image in the codomain, right? And only one image, right? So everything has to be mapped to something, right? Something in the codomain has to be mapped to something, in, or excuse me, everything in the domain must be mapped to something in the codomain and only one uh, image, right? And so that's the definition of being a well-defined function. So the well-defined well here means the same thing, right? So every vector in the domain must have an image or a representation in the codomain and only one representation and that's what we mean by being well defined so again just to, just to clarify and just a couple of remarks going forward okay that's it have a great day